Alright, welcome back everybody, welcome back to the Morphite Project. Yes, I know that this has been started earlier, but I forgot to put it on uh, 7 o'clock. Which, which is a big deal for me at least. Anyway, um, don't tell me, no. Hold on, fucking piece of shit. Tell me that you have at least your fucking shit. Please tell me that the stream is working, as intended. Oh no, yes. Alright, all right, it, it, is, it is working, as intended, cool. <sighs> Alright, now we can switch this to the big giant fruit. So the preview is uh, glitching up again. Great job, me. So today we're going to be working on these bad boys. Crystals. Ooh, ah. Uh, yes. So that's the idea. We're going to work on those, and then hopefully we are able to get them fixed, and then we can move onwards towards... Uh, you know, getting the feathers done again. So yeah, that's the idea. Uh, let's get to it, shall we? But yeah, the uh, the main the main problem I always face is like these things. Ugh. Well, it always has to be. You know, I'm trying to do things and then nothing comes as planned. Every fucking single time. So. What we want is this one. So yeah, um, let's see, I want this to be not as big, because otherwise the thing will not do, and we only need to be that on uh, tiny bits. That doesn't work, good. I pressed the right, I pressed the right card. Really, dude? Really? Oh, I hate this so much. Fine. 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 Does it work now? Yes. Let me guess. If I now remove this, I won't be able to remove the right thing. Alright, cool. Cool me. Cool beans. Chief Louise, ugh. I always hate it when I am, uh, you know, a little bit outdated. No, you don't want to control Z again? Come on. Control Z, please. Why you ain't working, my friends? That's bullshit. That's some baloney bullshit right there. Alright, and we only need to have like this kind of approach. More of this needed, and this needed. If I'm correct, that is enough, right? Yeah, that's enough to fill the whole damn thing up. Nice. Now we're gonna pick up the. Um, now we're gonna pick up the. What was it again? The. Blento, and then that should be working then fine. Which creates this, uh, which creates this effect. All right, cool. So that's the effect, but I don't need to have like a long-lasting one. So I need to switch them back to the color and then get. Oh, I can also do it with this. All right, cool. That's decent. There you go and then switch back to this one and then get this. Yeah. All right. Cool. Um, that's good enough. So, um, let's see. Now we need to actually get the other color here and fill up the points, pointy bits. 
3. This is also a call that, we, that doesn't work. <sighs> Alright, fine. I'll do it myself. Jeez Louise. Let me guess, because I did not use this one. Yeah, probably that's the way. Alright, uh, and how much do I want from this? I only need to have like this amount. This is a good amount. Alright, and now I can go for the blunt tool again, and then that would be working fine. Nice. Alright, cool. And now we can finally get the erase button here. Yeah. So the black part we need to do with uh, another, another tool then. Alright, cool. The darker part we need to do with another tool. This one we need to do with just casual tool. Alright, fine. I guess that's the way. Anyway, um, so uh, that's uh, that's good for me to know that I'm actually doing this the right way. Huh. Anyway, uh, so yeah, today is gonna be, you know, just a casual day of Mod Hopper. Just a casual day of Mod Hopper project, and uh, hopefully, you know, you guys are gonna be enjoying this. You know, we're working on the crystals, uh, well, I'm working on the crystals right now, and then once the crystals are done, we are gonna be calling it a day. Well, well, no, we're not gonna be calling it a day, then we can finally continue working on the till parts. Or whatever the parts are. Anyway. So yeah. Um, this beautiful, you know, drawing. It's uh, getting better and better all the time. So I'm very happy upon that. Like, for instance, I need, like... And then I can go back to Blur Tool. And then... Do that, boom, easy peasy, and I switch to the darker tone, which is this tone right here, and I can say like, well, where do I want this? Well, of course I want to have it like here, right here, so we want to probably not put it like that, we need the, yeah, we need that brush here. Yeah. And then we need to have now. The, now we need to have a blend tool, and then it should be fine. So we extend it, put it right there. And that should work, right? Well, it should work, but I need more. A little bit more darker, I need. And then I need to have the blur tool again. And then go back to the color. All right. All right. Now, since that we have done now the, uh, the 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 energy crystals, we can now go to the um. Now we can actually go to the to the till part again, and then you know fix that up because that needs to be fixed. So we have now the crystals done. So we have now crystals fully done. Now I believe yes, we do. And we can now start with the extraordinary thing of till parts. So uh, we want to have to look for the till. Ah, paint layer 25. There you go. Put that into a layer. Put it into a group. Now let's make some. Uh, 
Let's make it happen again. All right. Uh, first color of the day. I believe the first color that we want is actually the color this one here. Yeah. That's the first color that we need, right? It's just you know the casual, the casual brown color. Yes, the casual brown color is the first color that we need, and then go on from there. Now let's see. But we actually need to have like a little bit less brown. I believe then this one is the correct answer to that. No. All right. Allow me to pick up then the right color. So, yes, that is the exact color that I need. So I press this button and put it right here, and that would fix it. So we have this color, and this color needs to be here. All right. Well, looks like it is the same color. Cool. So yeah, we're gonna do that. We're gonna fix this up. Draw it in and you know continue here. Of course, we don't want to see the wings, so we need like. Yeah. There you go. Now I can see stuff that I don't use. You know, I can see like. All right. So how long is this tail gonna last? All right, it is not gonna be that. All right, cool. So we wanna move it until so the big fellas we don't want to touch and the little fellas we don't want to touch all right cool that's uh, that's doable it's until right here all right So these are the bottom feathers, which we of course have, and then now we're gonna push on from there. Um. So it's not here. Alright, cool. So this is all not there. So it's only this one here. Alright, cool. So we have the first column done, and then you know we're gonna work on that part next time. So we're gonna be working on the other color now and then get that color in as well. Is this the color that we need? Don't tell me this is the color that we need, right? Is this the brown color? Or is this the red color? Hmm. That's the red. Let's see. Alright, hold horses. Um so red is gonna be a thing that we need to do, so hmm. So first we're gonna use the first we're gonna do the white part. Which is gonna be a little bit and then you know, we're gonna continue from there. So yeah. Anyway, um, that's a lot, and we need to lower that down to f two or one. Hmm. At least this is good. Mm. 
Let's see. So yeah, uh, today I actually got today I actually had some curry. I made it myself, homemade, and uh, well, somehow I it worked again. So I'm very happy upon that result. The main pr issue I always have with curry is like it, it is good, it's really good and tasty, but it always takes so many time to prep. I need to cut all the resources, all the all the food, and then blend it into one pow, and then serve it up. But uh, yeah, it's a uh, it's a good thing to have curry. All right, let's see if I can go for the blend till now. Look at that, it's already taking it's already looking like it. Hmm. So yeah, the uh, amount of you know curry I made was actually for three per three people and uh, it was not too spicy, it was actually quite sweet. And that um, that was actually really handy dandy because if I make it too spicy, you know, nobody's gonna eat it. If I make it too little spicy, it won't it won't taste good. So I think I did it right. Also, it was actually Indonesian curry instead of, uh, you know, other types of curry, but eh. It was good curry, though. Put some pak soy into it and uh, some uh, spring leeks and uh, a leek and some onions. And uh, yeah, that was actually a very tasteful, tasteful meal. It was very healthy either. So, uh, I guess that's what you get when you're trying to do stuff like, you know. That's a great question. Why is this look so odd compared to the other one? Why is it looking so odd? Hmm. Hmm. Is it because the color is wrong? Is it because the color is wrong? Is it because the color is wrong? That's the question. Is it because the color is wrong? Let's take a look at it. I guess, I guess the color was wrong here, but then also this color is wrong, otherwise it won't work. So if I now go here, fix that color by putting the color into it, so I want to have the brown, brown right there, and I put the brown in. That's not what I wanted. I want the brown in there. I want the brown in there, so I need to go over here and color it there. Nothing changed. Huh. So the color is correct, but why the hell is it because of the red? Is it because of all the red? Yeah, probably it is. Huh. Strange. Very, very strange. Anyway, let's continue with the color that we had. So yeah, it is very strange that such thing can happen, you know, or occur. So we want this, and we don't want to color that in here. Did we destroy the coloration here? Did we? 
No, we did not. All right, cool. Good. So yeah, um, apparently we ruined. Oh well, apparently we need to get the right color in to get the uh, next effect on it. Huh? Who knew that was that was actually a thing? I didn't. All right. So yeah, this is like difficult because I'm like, eh, I have no idea what I'm doing right now. Well, I'm doing the same thing as I always do, drawing, dr uh, coloring feathers, but hopefully this will work. Hopefully this will, you know, create a pattern that I that I'm satisfying with. That's the idea. But yeah, um, today I had like a lovely day. Um, made curry, made food, and uh, it was tasteful. So no need to say that it was bad or anything like that. Because sometimes that can happen as well. Having bad eat eat bad stuff it makes you wonder what the hell you just did to your food and then it's like, ah yes, I made this mistake or that mistake. And mistakes are important. For instance, I know that once I make my food and I realize like I ruined it, um I'm always like, ah boy oh boy, what I'm gonna be doing now. So I'm always trying to get in a second backup plan because I am not a very good cook when it comes to cooking. I prefer easy food to hard food, but once I'm getting, once I know how to make something, I can make it. And then I know, like, oh well, time to make it anyway again. So, yeah. I always have, like, easy food, like schnitzels or, um,. Uh, how do you say beans with potatoes and I mean, casual stuff and uh yeah beans are very easy to pr uh, very easy to make they're actually the easiest part i believe beans are like uh one of those things that you want to have uh if you are like you know you're not good at cooking well make some cook some beans that that's not difficult it's like Two minutes of work, and then you know you have already your sh already your stuff. Of course, they don't produce a lot of vegetable, uh, well, a lot of vitamins, and you need vitamins in your food. So then you need something like easy to be eaten, and that can be combined with beans. So broccoli, that's actually one of the easiest things to make. Well, not the, one of the easiest things to make, but it is a very Nice food. Yeah. <laughs> it's very nice, people. Very nice. Broccoli. It is not combinable with beans, though. Um, what is combinable with beans? Technically, technically nothing. Nothing of the fr nothing of the fruits. Uh, maybe, yeah. Well, yes, maybe. Uh, peeled beans. No, uh, the little things, the green beans. Maybe the green, uh, maybe the pl uh, uh, split bean. Uh, we have like two types of beans. We have like the green beans and we have the white beans. And the white beans we always use for bean uh, to reference as beans. And the other one is actually a vegetable. It's very confusing. But yeah, maybe that one because it has no taste. It has like no taste at all. It's like, what do you eat? I am eating rubber plants. Nom nom nom. <laughs> I must say that's actually one of the worst kind of food you can ever have. It's not my likable food. Definitely not. I I prefer ve I prefer vegetables that have a little bit of flavor to them because holy hell. If you ever get ser if you ever get those types of things served, it's like, what do I need to do with it? Eat them. But they taste not too. They taste absolutely like nothing. Yes, because we have like frog beans, and frog beans are like green beans that are tiny, and they are like you know squished. So they 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 taste very bad if you are putting them. If you don't cook them too good. Ah, oh, great! My head is also spinning. Ah, that's uh. That's a, that's a, that's a no bueno. Great, no bueno. I also totally, you know, totally forgot to put this on. 
uh, at the beginning, you know. Apologies for that. So, hopefully, you know, this will be fine now. So, what I'm going to be doing, you know, today is like, as always, all the other day, you know, drawing, coloring. Maybe if I, maybe if I do this, or I have this and I put this off, off. Why is it then like this? All right, cool. Found your color, you da you dummy. Found your color. Why is your color like this? Because this is the tips. Yes. All right, that's cool. So now tell me. All right, cool. And now if I now go for alpha, put this back into position. I will have the right color now, yeah. Don't I? Yes, I do. Finally, I have the correct color. Jeez Louise, that took me way too long. So tell me. That's the right color, right there. And now it's the question like, alright, cool. So. Why did it go bad? Well, I have no idea why this one go bad. But I'm glad I found the color. Otherwise, I would not have been able to color to, to color it correctly. Well, according to the color, of course, because that was way too dark color, and that that is not supposed to be happening. So this is the base color, and this is the light color, and then we need to have the brownish red. No, and then we need to have the brownish red brown. Oh boy, um, there you go. And we're gonna go back here. So why is this like that? I have no idea. Also, why is this not able to get towards that? Yes. Do we really need to use the old fashioned pencil for this? Oh, wait, I'm selecting the wrong color. Damn it. Do we need to have the old fashioned brush here for this? Yes, we do. Alright, fine, 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 fine. Since that we want to have like a good old fashioned, why do we want to have to call, go for the old fashioned brush? Because then we can actually extend stuff, which makes things less l less weird to look at. Also, I can add like you know little brush strokes to it, and that that's all we need. Like we don't need to have all all that color thing, but. Be nice if I had like that, and then I can change this to this, and then I can change this to little size. Yep, awesome. All right, cool. We can now finally start getting things. Because sometimes instant speed, instant color is not very good because you need to actually use a blend tool or something like that to compensate with with the downsides of it. And uh, well, you know, I didn't do that, or you know, the the blur tool could not reach it because it was too bit too little to work with. So I need to manually do this. Well, you know, better doing man manually than doing it wrong. I guess there is no hard. I guess there is no hard. Well, not not a hard feeling, but I guess there is no hard wrong to this. Anyway, um, so yeah, that this is the project, and I'm really happy upon this project because this project l let me learn a lot of stuff. And the stuff normally is not like interesting at all, but it is all the stuff that you know guides you towards your end goal. It's the stuff that 
helps you understand like why do I need to do this why do I need to use this specific pr procedure to reach the goal or the end goal that that I want why can we not just you know do this or that or su such thing as you know why can we not shove it somewhere else or break somebody else's bones for this and it's like well, you need to understand that these thing that this all needs to be planned ahead, or well, not planned ahead. I mean, it all needs to be, it all needs to do their own job, and you know, it cannot function without the proper tools and the proper preparation and the proper things that it does. So yeah, um, the this is a very terrible explanation. I just noticed it like ah. Uh, Johan, that's not a very good explanation. Why? Why would you do this? And it's like, yeah, I'm doing this because I need to learn how to do stuff. And this project always taunts me. It's like, huh? You wanted to do this, but hey, look at me. I'm resisting your thoughts. <laughs> that's always what it is. It's always like this nasty little bugger who always is like one step ahead of you. When you finally solve a problem, you instantly get a new problem occurring at your doorstep. And that's why, you know, we want to prevent that. I want to create this effect that, you know, is already everywhere. The effect of, you know, this pattern right here in the feathers. And I want to, I want this pattern to be also here. And the only way to do that is by, you know, reproducing the pattern again uh, by hand and the main problem is that that reprodu reproduction you know when you do copied stuff you uh, you sometimes get errors you know if you copy someone's homework it's not always the same unless you know you know that there are correct unless you know he wrote all down all the correct answers but that's not always the case and not everybody writes the exam exactly how you supposed to write it or how somebody else is writing it so you have this shitty handwriting in front of you and then the next time you have like this good handwriting that you can just instantly copy so the problem the problem lies within you know the multi mul multitude of you know uh, ways of how to reach to the end goal and for now I'm like trying to get my self you know get myself motivated get myself up and running dealing with this problem head-on and uh, hopefully winning and so far you know I'm not having a pro I'm not having a hard time here I'm just you know a little bit annoyed that you know the some of the brushes ain't working well you know they worked before just fine And they are all dependent because of, you know, the way of how I do this. And I was dependent on the arts, I was dependent on the pattern by using the brushes. And now I can't, so I need to figure out what and how again and again and again until, you know, we finally find out how to do it. So let's put put a hold. Yeah, that's that's decent. That will Then this will all cancel out once... Uh, Alright, cool. So... Now we've done that. We actually now need um, this one. We do have the heavy eraser for this. This is a very sticky, a sticky problem. All right, cool. Now we can continue on, you know, getting the third color in, and that's the red one. Uh, when does the red one occur? The red one only occurs at long distances, so we should, eh, only the dark one. Then we need to do. All right, so we need a second color over this one, and then. Uh, wing, 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 uh, wing, there you go. So we need to have not this color. Ah, 
this one. All right, cool. And then this one closed. So this is the third color that we need, and that color is ba -ba -ba -ba. very dark brown, right? Yes, very dark brown. So we need to pick up very dark brown, Charlie Brown. We need him. We need the dark brown of doom, and uh, we're gonna y we're gonna take it and use it for our own gains. So now we're gonna go back to the part that we are at, and then put ourselves like. Where do we need to put this? Halfway. All right. So halfway, we need to put this. So where is halfway in this one? Uh, let's see. Here. So these are the colors that we need, and now we need to actually blend that in with the environment, I believe. So we need to have this and then add the other color into it. Oh boy, this is going to be a nightmare to do, isn't it? Yep, it is. I should definitely use red first and then go for the one. So... Which one is this? Then that's the color. No, we need to actually move this downwards, so we need to have like underneath the color that we had. Alright, so, and now we can see if we can put the blend tool on this. Hopefully, we can. Alright. All right. Uh, damn it, mate. Let's see how much time. Oh, 40 minutes already. Nice. Ah, this is a difficult one to do. Definitely one of my hardest achieve. Well, not hardest achievements, but these are my hardest things to work around. But because we are like you know using two colors and then you know we're adding a new color to it and then we need to do a second color as well which is the brown so we have now this so we now have this which is doable yes true but we actually need to have the red soon afterwards so we need the color red into the uh... side? no not side um... We need to color. We need to color red in the wings a little bit. So technically, the red needs to be on the top. So I should technically work with the red first and then do the one, other one. Uh, yes, I should. I definitely should. I definitely fucking should. Why oh, is this not working? I'm pressing the red button here and why is it not work? Why? <laughs> no. No. What? Uh, 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 what? What the? Alright, what the? Why? The? Alright, why is this an inverse? Why is this an inverse? What the hell did I press that it is an inverse? Alright, why is now an inverse? Tell me. Please, tell me. No, we don't wanna, we don't wanna have an inverse. We don't want, we don't need, we don't need a we don't need white, alright, we wanna have red. Why do we have white? When I said in particular that I want to have red. K. 
Come on. I want red. There you go, red. All right. Now, let's see. So I want to have red. Like that. Yes. And that will work. Yeah, that will work. Is it better to go for this one kind of approach? Yes, it is. All right. Why is this so difficult sometimes to do? So it's all brown and then right. <laughs> God dang it. So if we have this kind of effect, does that. Does that achieve the goal of, you know, the in part? Tell me, please, yes. Well, yes, that is actually good enough. We don't have, we don't need the red part into it. I believe. Uh, do we need to have red into this one? Mm. Mm. Maybe. <sighs> we do need to make it darker, so we should put a darker layer on it, just to get you know everything to a little bit darker, so uh, darker look. Otherwise, this one. Otherwise, this one look the same. I believe that's good enough. Yes, that's good enough. If we add some dark, you know, um, paintbrush to it. So if we have like this, and we put a layer on this, and then put like this. Then yes, that would be enough. Nice. All right, so that will work. All right, cool. Uh, oh man, I'm I'm so tired already from this. Not because I need, to, beca not because you know it is a lot of work. It is just a fucking a lot of focus. It's like, argh. so yeah. Anyway, now let's take a look at this right now. So we have now the wing. We have the we have the crystals done, which we can change on command uh, a different color if we want to. Check. Uh, we have the tail part now complete so we need to find out where this part is and hopefully we can work around with that uh, let's see and then once we're at this part we can then add this part here and then go to uh, the bottom side which I believe we also need to color in um, yes alright cool 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 so we st we're, on, we're, on, we're on track we're on track we, we finished this one which we promised to do finish one and we did not do it fully then <sighs> crystals this one right crystals yeah. I forgot to erase some stuff here my bad
All right. And end this part on me. But yeah, the uh, main issue here was, you know, this. This is a lot of stuff I need to do. And I need to always do this, like, you know, one here and there. Alright, um, let's see. Now, uh, five minutes left. Let's make a little mental note here. So, let's see where we need to go down from now. So, since already went, since this is the two, where is the. So, we have paint layer tail here, paint layer tail there, yes. Um, where, where we have class here, we have the class on this side. So we have claw one and two and three. So this one. All right, cool. So we should then go for claw claw F. Uh, claw four. There you go. That's claws. Then we have the legs. We don't want to go for the legs. We actually want to go for the wings. No, we don't want to go for the wings. We want to go to maybe go up. That's the hair. That are those things. Uh, nope. That is the other layer. So we need to go find the other layer under it. This one. This one right here we need. Alright, cool. Blah. Now we need this one, yeah. So this, uh, no, this is the layer for the one that we need to go for. So we're gonna add a group here, put a quick group, so that we finally can get everything on that color there. All right, cool, cool. Ah, uh, I got this. I got this. I got this. So yeah. We need to work with. We're gonna work now on these feathers, which are the big feathers, which do contain red. Yes. All right. The big feathers do contain red. The the little feathers don't contain red. All right. Keep that in mind. Yeah. All right. So that's gonna be good for tomorrow. And that's gonna be good for Monday. So, red, not red. Big feathers, red. Non little feathers, non red. Alright, cool. Cool, 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 cool. So eh, I must say it's already looking nice. It's 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 decent already looking. It's it's getting color, it's getting it's getting shape, it's getting nice look to it. Yeah, yeah I would say that. Definitely. So today we fixed it today we fixed the crystals. We started with the tail part and tomorrow we're gonna oh well Monday we're gonna fin we're gonna fi uh, get to the second part of the tail, which is gonna be including the uh, l larger feathers, which then need to contain red. All right, got that out of my system. Good. Um. Anyway, I wish you all I wish you all the best of day uh, best of days. Um, don't mind me if I save this. Don't mind me if I do. So that I'm instantly at uh, layer uh, 64 paint. Yep. All right. Cool. Uh, anyway, um, thanks all for watching, and uh, I'll see you all next time. Sorry that I was not a little bit talkative here. I I was way too busy with coloring, and that uh, that that is normal. But uh, oh well. Um, it happens. Uh, anyway, I wish you all a, ha a nice day. And uh, thanks all for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Until then, uh, bye!